Except there was one more speaker at this event, along with Ted Cruz and Sarah Palin, co-opting this event that the veterans say was supposed to be apolitical, turned into a Tea Party rally, where, by the way, there's pictures shown of Confederate flags being flown. Yep. And take this country back. You know how they love that one. That's like the South Al-Qaeda yes. running their flag. The was terrorists it? who tried to break up this country. There was another speaker. Larry Clayman. All right, we'll play this. He's part of the Tea Party movement. Let's play this. To Allah. Yeah. yeah. Imperialistic president. Who bows down to Allah. Yeah. yeah. Whose rules of engagement for our veterans don't allow us to defend ourselves properly. Who are dying per capita in greater numbers in Afghanistan than ever died in any American war. And I know because I represent some of the families. And I feel personally involved. This president is not a president of we the people. No. No. He's, he's the president of his people. He's to be the president of all of us. That's what he said he was going to be. He's to stand here with the veterans. This this is un this is what he this is this is how they co-opted this veteran this apolitical veteran protest to attack the president by invoking him being on his knees praying to Allah asking why isn't he down there at this obvious tea party rally in which I'm sure he would have gotten a great reception you know All right uh, but this Larry Clayman wasn't done let's hear this second piece of sound I do not advocate violent revolution to the contrary in the style of Mahatma Gandhi in the style of Lech Walesa in Poland, who brought down communism. In the style of Martin Luther King, who stood up there many years ago and declared freedom. I call upon all of you to wage a second American nonviolent revolution, to use civil disobedience, and to demand that this president leave town to get out, to put the Quran, to put the Quran down to get up off his knees and to figuratively come up with his hands out. Put the Quran down. This is what they're invoking. This president is not like you and me. We have to take this country back. Confederate flag flying high. And they're using this as a way, and they're co-opting these veterans who wanted an apolitical event to co-op, and they co-opt this event. And again, uh, ben Shapiro, Ben Shapiro over at Breitbart, uh, used this uh, opportunity, this this uh, Larry Clayman to say how the the left and the mainstream media are using this one man, this one individual, to 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 take us all and to say we're all Tea Party crazies. He says how uh, it was unfair. It was just one speaker, Larry Clayman, and they're trying to lump in Sarah Palin and Ted Cruz in with him. And I think it's important here, while Ben Shapiro over at Breitbart doesn't mention it, uh, funny enough, uh, Clayman is actually one of his co-workers because Clayman is actually a contributor for Breitbart.com. 